What's up guys, it's Mr. Logan, and I just want to say I miss you guys so much at school every day, and I hope things are going okay for you guys at home. Hey, I just thought it'd be a cool thing if I read a story to you guys. This is a kid's book that actually my wife and I made together. I wrote the words and then my wife drew the pictures, and so I hope you guys enjoy. It's called Rico's Maracas. Rico's Maracas, written by me, Mr. Logan and illustrated by my wife, Mrs. B. On a small jungle island far, far away, if you listen very, very carefully, you could hear a drum pounding, a guitar strumming, a piano playing, and a deep voice singing. It was the sound of the jungle band. They would play their instruments every day and every night. All of the other jungle animals would dance to the sound of their music. All of the other animals, except Rico, that is. Rico would get sad when he heard the jungle band's music playing. You see, Rico wanted to be a part of the jungle band, but there was just one problem. Rico was a snake, which means he didn't have any arms or any legs, so he couldn't possibly play an instrument in the jungle band. There's Rico saying, I wish I was a part of the jungle band. Oh, poor Rico. When Rico tried playing the drums, he had no hands to hold onto the drumsticks. When he tried strumming the guitar, he would get his long, skinny body tangled up in the strings. When he tried playing the piano, he had no fingers to press the keys. And when he tried singing into the microphone, his long snake tongue kept getting in the way. So he sounded like this. Rico became very upset when he could not play any of the instruments. So he slithered across the ground into the bushes. He was so angry that he, he began to shake. Meanwhile, the jungle band was playing their music nearby, when suddenly they heard a noise coming from the bushes. They said to each other, what's that noise? That would be the perfect sound for our band. As they peeked into the bushes, they were surprised to find that it was Rico. It turns out that Rico was a rattlesnake and his special little rattle at the end of his tail was the perfect sound for the jungle band. Even though Rico couldn't play instruments like the rest of the animals, he had his own special sound that only he could play. And now, if you listen very, very carefully to that small jungle island far, far away, you can hear a drum pounding, a guitar strumming, a piano playing, a deep voice singing, and a little rattle at the end of a tail shaking. And that is the end of our story, Rico's Maracas. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I hope you guys are staying safe out there at home. I can't wait till we can be together again, hopefully next school year. Peace out, guys.